what's up guys and welcome back to overkill gaming your home for high-end gaming whether it's pc ps5 or handheld we got you covered today we're going to be taking a look at destiny 2 running on the steam deck now for those of you who are unaware destiny 2 is not compatible with steam os at all you actually have to install windows in order to play this game on the steam deck and so that's what we've done we've actually created a dual boot system with Windows and SteamOS on the Steam Deck. We have Windows installed on an SD card, which we can just insert into the bottom. And we have our games loaded on there for Windows. And then we have the SteamOS side, which is still on the internal SSD. And these two are separate, so they don't affect each other at all. And I'll probably follow up with a video shortly after this on how to do that. And this setup will ensure that you can play just about any game, especially the games that have anti-cheats that are built specifically for Windows and will not allow you to play them on any other operating system. So that's why we had to install Windows. And as you can see, it's gonna run pretty well here. And like I said, we do have Windows installed on an SD card, 512 gigabytes, which is more than enough for the operating system and some games. So and it's a 512 gigabyte model Steam Deck as well. So we have 512 gigabytes for SteamOS and 512 gigabytes for Windows. Now, if you guys enjoyed today's video, please be sure to leave a like on the video and consider subscribing so that way you don't miss out on any of our future content. Lots of great content on this channel for the Steam Deck. And we also cover PC and PS5 as well. And you definitely don't want to miss it. are setting up a giant cannon. I have an idea. Head inside and get me to a console.
console. Let's see how this cannon works. I heard Sabaton went into hiding thanks to the Awoken Queen, Marasal. So why is she showing herself again so soon? Seems too reckless for a god of cunning. you're thinking but trust me this will work my plans always work let's start with opening the fuel lines
there it is guys destiny 2 the witch queen running on the steam deck via windows 10 man and it ran pretty good i, I know i didn't have the overlay set up on this i had a little issue with that but if you can look in the top right hand corner it's really small you can see that we're getting anywhere between 45 and 60 fps just depending on what's going on so as you can see this is one of the benefits of having windows uh windows dual boot system is that for these games that have an anti-cheat that prevents you from playing on steam os you have full access on the windows side so there you go hope you guys enjoyed this if you did make sure to leave a like and also consider subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out on our future content we plan to do a lot more videos like this also going to do a windows doable tutorial so hope you guys stay tuned for that thank you so much we'll see you in the next one peace